I got him. Oh, nice. Yo, do you almost have your um, ammo pack? Oh! Oh! <laughs> what the hell? We're good. We're good. Nope, we're not. Oh, it's doing that freaking. What did it's I doing the glitch do? where it won't let me pick up ammo. Oh that actually pisses my. me off, bro. Especially because I'm on a streak. What did and I just do? Again. Clip Wait it. I'm just sitting right here, watch. Oh, oh my god, do you like my chopper? Chopper's going nice. What? Too bad. Yo, YouTube, what up, guys? Uh, first of all, man, enjoy this gameplay in the background. We do drop a nuke yeah, I will um, a on grind. Uh, oh, I don't. I think it was a deathmatch dom is what we were playing. Goodness. But we do drop a nuke, so uh, yeah, like, appreciate the gameplay in the background. Want, but anyways, like, the main I, point of the video today, way, I want to talk about yes, bro, I the modern worry. warfare beta um, this past weekend. The first uh, weekend it went live for PS4 users. I don't want you to have to pay for a code, bro. This weekend will will be crossplay with other Xbox users, so I'm really excited for that. But anyway, let's just get into it. Uh, this is my honest thoughts and opinions, want, maybe stuff that needs to be changed, but, uh, just some code, of my opinions, you know I mean? man, so don't get yeah, I'm gonna put too butthurt about what I think like, and I just don't feel like it's what I think they need to do to make it a, a more fun game. But anyway, let's get to it. Um, no, I mean, first of all, the main issue, like, everybody yeah, already but, knows, like, it's a mini-map, right? Like, um, personally, do I want it? I do. Um, it's just, it's a Call of Duty feel. I want the, I want the mini-map. Um, yeah, is it a necessity? Okay. Like, do I need it? No, yeah, I don't. I um, it'll take me more, uh, it'll take me longer to get used to. And I think it does promote camping. But that's just my opinion, okay? I think it does promote uh, camping. And maybe this is how the game will be played. And that, maybe we'll have to adjust to that. But really that's that. That's a different it, story. But I'm just hoping we do yeah, get a UAV or a mini map, excuse me. And it does come back just like every other Call of Duty, man. I don't want them to change their roots to make it more realistic. Well, it, the game is already very realistic in the terms of no minimap. The time to kill, which we'll get into, all the other stuff. But I do want there to be a minimap overall. But if not, I'll adjust and I'll get good at it and I'll just play it until I'm good at it. So either way, I'm fine with it. But obviously, I would like to see one um, in the full release. And I know they're testing stuff out. They're doing a good job with that. So anyway, that's that's the minimap. That's my situation. Okay, one more thing I guess I would say with the minimap. If there is no minimap, I feel that there should you should be able to lap streaks. Uh, UAVs and personal radars like that's my opinion. I think that would do no, I think that would make it a lot better if there is no mini map um, I don't think I don't know see why you can't lap streaks like it just doesn't seem right like if you're rewarded and you're going off in this called Call of Duty I think it would be harder to go off in like just to get a ton of kills I think you should be rewarded for doing well, so I think you should be able to lap streaks, and I think that would be good for the game, and good for people that are playing well and having some fun, cutting their streaks, and the streaks are dominant, I do like them, so it'll be fun to use those, so I think that's one thing they should change, if there is no minimap. Um, at least show the red dots on the compass. We do have red dots on the compass, and I think those are a good uh, implement. I don't think enough people use that. If you guys didn't realize, there is a red dots on the top of your screen when you have a radar, and you can see all the direction of enemies. So that's just another thing. But I overall, I do want the mini map, like I said. But anyway, let's get to the next point. Um, a couple other things I did enjoy a lot: the gunsmith. Um, the gunsmith is amazing. It's very, very cool how they did it. Um, Oh my god. They have so many different attachments oh and varieties god. that you can have for weapons. We didn't Yo, even what see happened, what it's capable Yo. of, honestly. Oh, like, we just got a little bit of it. You know, it's the beta, so they're not giving us much. And we just got a little bit of it, and to me, it was amazing. So I cannot wait to see what it actually is like, full release, and what how many attachments, what, kind, what you can do to weapons, all that kind of stuff. So I'm super excited for that. And just to see what we're able to do, customize it, make it our own game. And I think they're going to do the, the best job with that in any Call of Duty uh, that we've ever had. Just by customization-wise, uh, weapon attachments. Hopefully they have good camos. I don't know what they'll do since it's super realistic. I don't, I'm not sure if they're going to drop a ton of camos or like that. Like I don't know if they'll have a diamond camo. Maybe if they go back to Red Tiger or something, keep it more simple, which the game is because you only have five attachments for weapons. So they kept it super simple. You get one perk, or three perks. You pick your three perks. You pick your five attachments for each weapon. So if you're running overkill, you can have two weapons with five attachments, which is very OP. 
and I think a sniper SMG class setup if you're having playing a certain map is a very good setup. Stuff like that, guys. So hopefully you do um, try that out because that's that's just so OP. You guys will love it. Try and overkill. I never ran it before, but I just felt like in this Call of Duty, it's very that's very awesome to do. Um, anyway, uh, let's get into time to kill a little bit. Time to kill is something that going from Black Ops 4 where I grinded to uh, this Call of Duty. Um, I feel like I think it has the rainbow, rainbow Siege factor, which is um, it has a headshot multiplier. So if you get headshots, it's one to two bullets, and that's what it felt like in this beta. I'm not sure what it, the exact percentage is or what it is for just getting headshots, but I know there is a multiplier to it. I wish I had the exact uh, number and what of what it really did, but sometimes you would shoot first. Say I got three body shots, boom, headshot, one shot done. Like that's how quick it felt. So I'm not sure what that is. I don't know if that'll change. It's very realistic. You get shot in the head, obviously, it, boom, you're dead, right? But that's something I'll have to get uh, used to. As a Pomod said, aim higher. That's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm aiming higher, man. Trying to get these headshots. Um, I think it'll be very easy to get your camos, especially if it's just the regular 100 headshots, boom, get this camo, 50 headshots, boom, you know what I mean? So the headshots is going to be crazy. Um, it already is crazy in the beta, so I don't know if they'll change it or if they'll leave it how it is. But either way, I'm going to get used to it. Um, your aim's got to be on point, and that's one thing. Uh, one people, I had some tweets when I was messing around saying BO4 takes more skill um, than Modern Warfare at this point, in which, to me, I felt like it did from the beta. Um, people complaining about my tweet saying that. I appreciate like, that, uh, come on, guys. Like, how much skill did this really take? The only skill that I think, or two skills that I think it's going to take uh, more than BO4 right now, right now will be... Map awareness, which will be huge. Map awareness will be huge, and that's that's a huge factor. That's Call of Duty. Boom, map awareness. You're going to have to know the maps, or you won't do good. That's just plain and simple with the style of play this is. And I would say your accuracy, your first shot accuracy. Um, and even if you're, somebody gets lucky and they're not near as good as players, you, they're not near as skilled, they can still kill you. That's why, in my opinion, it didn't take much skill. In BO4, you had to hit seven to six to six six shots. Depending on what weapon you're using, sometimes more, sometimes less if you're using the Rampart or Titan. You guys know what I mean by that. But you had to hit your shots. You could heal up super fast, too, with stim shots. So you might put 500 damage into one guy and not even get the kill. You know what I mean? So you have to hit your shots with uh, on BO4. That's why I said it is more of that kind of terms. You have to hit your shots. Um on BO4, on MW, like I got destroyed by dudes where their accuracy went up in the air and they shot the trigger before their bullet, or they pulled the trigger before the ADS and their one bullet killed me, like in the head. And, I was, and, their, and when the ADS, like they're, it's like 10 feet above me or 10 feet to the left or right. So I know they weren't the best player ever and are new to the beta. And it's just, that was frustrating. And I did get shot. I did shoot a lot and I got uh, some hit markers in the body. Then boom, I get one shot to the head. So that's one thing I'll have to adjust to, which I know that's just me not hitting my headshots, right? But it's just something that's different. And to me, it didn't take as much skill, especially when the other person got lucky. It's what it looked like. Um, uh, time to kill, like I said, super fast. Um, the maps are also a huge issue, I think, uh, to people. And they're very new. They're very different, very new. That's something uh, we'll have to adjust to completely. They're not three-lane maps anymore. They're like 55-lane maps, and there's about four stories to each uh, building. So that's something that we will have to adjust to, and it'll take some time. Um, so especially playing BO4, you have your three-lane. Uh, just watching my gameplay, guys, I know where people are going to be. I, I know what the spawns are, which will take time, but I'll figure it out in uh, Modern Warfare. But it won't be as easy, in my opinion, because there's so many levels, so many head glitches that you can get shot from, which is insane. I think they need to cut that down a little bit because it does promote camping, and that's why I don't want Call of Duty to be. Um, like, I have a play style, which I will have to change it if it's like this, which is fine, but it'll, just, it'll take me time, like I said. But my play style, I rush around. I love to use it like on BO4, the Maddox, as you guys can see. And I love to just get out there and try to get as many kills as possible, you know. Um, when I was trying to do that in MW, it was not working out for me. I got slowly better towards the end of the beta. And I hopefully will figure out a class up I want to run and do all that good stuff. But I like, I love the beta, though, overall, guys. Like, I can't wait. 
until the full release. And I can't wait to play my buddies that have Xbox as well. I think that's something huge that they're doing. I think it'll bring the community together even more. It'll probably be more toxic, <laughs> but it'll bring a lot of people together as well. So I'm very excited for that. Um, any other point? I'm trying to think of some other points I maybe you guys want to come across. Uh, the map, the, the lanes, the head glitches. I mean, that's just some of the main stuff I've seen on social media and stuff like that but that's i just wanted to cover that for you and i, I if you have any other questions or comments of what i thought i i know i didn't cover everything i there's probably gonna be a few points um that i don't cover that i want to that i wish i would have but i know i'll forget some and i'll remember right after i'm done recording this but if you have any other questions comments concerns whatever let me know and i'll try to answer them and let you know what i feel but overall guys i love the beta it's completely different i think we needed a change right um it's gonna be fun it's gonna be challenging and i love challenges i'm a competitive not competitive cod player i'm a competitive person so I love challenges and I love uh, mixing it up and trying to get better and learn some stuff. So can't wait for that. Um, if there's a mini map, perfect. If there's not, so be it. I will have to get used to it. And if I have a bad KD this year, I have a bad KD at first, but I know what I'll pick it up. And it's just getting used to it, guys. So that's what that is. Um, Anyway, guys, I appreciate you guys watching. Enjoy this little last part of this clip for this, me getting the nuke, and I will see you guys in the next one. Row kill is out. Almost back to back nuke. These choppers beats are crazy. Oh, the attack choppers are like the best. Yeah, they smoke, bro. Okay, B. Tie choppers are the best, man. Damn, that's dope. Are you going to stream full time now or not yet? No, man, no, not even close. I heal. What do you ask for? Well, I'm streaming full time. I said not even close. Yeah, not even close. No, no I got a full time job, Me dude. Either. I'm a, I'm I'm a teacher and shit, either. bro. Like, I'm chilling. I got the nuke. Got the nuke. Let's go, baby. GG. Got the nuke. Let's go. Would you stop teaching, bro? What? Would you stop teaching if you went like crazy? Like, are you starting you going mean crazy like, on YouTube and stuff? On Twitch and bro, stuff? What? I love what I do, though. I love what I do, but like if I, oh yeah, man. oh yeah, if I like had the chance to make thousands on here, I mean, like, what other job would you ask for? You know what I mean? Yeah, facts, but. Imagine sitting down here. Oh, I'm, I'm starting to get mad. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna wake up and freaking just play Call of Duty all day and make hella money. Exactly, bro. No, but like, it, I, like it'd be like I'm gonna teach as long as possible, man. But that's a long way from now talking about that shit, though. Talking about what? <laughs> Ever doing These this? These guys are boo boo. You said talking about what? Uh, like full time streaming and shit. Nah, not really. What? You gotta be making, bro. That's, you gotta. Be... I mean, well, I guess for you, yeah, 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 for sure, for you, for you, for you. It's true. It's true. I mean, not for me. Well, I mean, I have a job. I'm not gonna stop my job to like. Do something that I make less money, you know what exactly. I'm saying? Like, exactly. I make decent exactly. money, so I'm not like. <laughs> exactly. I'm about to say, not for me, bro. True. Like, do you work, uh, Venom? You work, don't you? Mm. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. Got the nuke, baby. Let's go. I'm gonna see if I can get one more kill right here. Oh, let's go, bro. All right, you sit me in front of quick. I got you.